the open plan so they can see. Uh, sure. And actually, about the prior one, about the healthcare, one easily implemented thing would be a pan European electronic uh, pharmacy uh, prescription system so that if you're traveling and you need your insulin or your other medication, you can easily walk into any Europe because most countries actually already have an electronic system, they're just not connected. So that's something that might be easy to go. And I'm actually a, a physician and I work in several different European countries and, uh, and it's, it's a nightmare, even though technically it shouldn't be, uh, because to get your funds, to access your funds, to transfer funds, to pay your funds, you have to have a bank account in every different country. Uh, some countries, like my home country in Hungary, uh, were silly enough not to take the euro. And because of this idiocracy of an idiot prime minister, uh, it costs everybody a fortune, basically, because there's additional funds involved. And in Europe, we should be European, and the base currency should be the euro, no matter if the country opts to take it or not, since the banks are working in the euro by themselves. MasterCard is actually a euro-based uh, electronic funds transaction system, so uh, it shouldn't be an obstacle to be able to have, for instance, my Hungarian currency put into a euro bank account without additional fees, surcharges, taxes, and all that stuff applied to it because I'm basically paying for my government's mistake. And that's very unfair, I think. So that was my proposal.